Kalau saya cakap, nanti kamu leput nanti. Alright, huh? so better saya tak cakap. Okay. The only things that I can say you need to find as much as possible. The sky is the limit. Okay. But, but not to save time, but not to help you to focus. Right, huh? uh, if you talk, uh, kalau you concern uh, in term of number, how many articles is sufficient? I just put there, uh, I just like to say that try to find the recent study. Recent study. Recent study meaning within five years. Right, huh? Today, 25th of October 2021. So you need to trace back the previous study related to your interested area, which is published, started in 2017. Okay. Right now. Huh? So I repeat, try to find the recent study. Recent study meaning the articles have been published. Right, huh? start right, since 2017 until now. Okay, don't be surprised. 2021 belum habis lagi. Right, dah some journal dah publish articles. Right, dah which is dia punya date 2020, eh 2022. Alright, but that's okay. Alright, that's the different reason for the publications. Right, ah so lima orang, you bagi bagi lah. Maksudnya A, you cari artikel yang publish 2017. B, cari artikel uh, publish 2018, 19, 20, 21, macam tu. Okay, dan cari as much as possible. Then, every article, right, uh, you need to read, right, uh, and uh, put in the summary table. Right, uh, everyone, each of you, right, uh, please use this table. Example table here. Right, huh? the full articles, references. Right, huh? you need to read. Right, huh? what are the objective of the articles? Right, huh? what the methodology used in the articles? What are the dependent variable? What are independent variable? And probably they have other variable. Right, huh? what are the main findings? Okay. Right, huh? So they are shortcut to do this. Right, huh? References. Right, huh? So you need to know this is the article and what year they publish. Right, huh? Objective. Where you can find the objective? Right, huh? uh, okay. Put it like this. Basically, uh, academic article, they have a section Right, uh, top section they call abstract. Okay, uh, kebanyakan wajib right, uh, articles, academic articles, they are top section known by the title situ abstract. Right, where you need to nak tanya, you need to read the abstract. Right, the abstract will give you uh, the complete overview about the articles. Right, huh? When you find the article, whether this article, right, huh? article tersebut yang kamu jumpa relevan ataupun tidak, baca dia punya uh, abstract. Right, huh? So, in the abstract, will uh, give you the ideas whether this uh, particular article useful or not. If it related match with your title, right, yeah, your suggested title, so you download, baru you download. Nah, nah, you download, cari yang artikel yang ada full text. Right, nah, kalau uh, walaupun dia related, right, nah, tapi tak ada full artikel, you can skip. Don't waste your time. Right, nah, force yourself to find the articles. Okay? So, each article, right, nah, you put uh, in this uh, in this form. Okay? Kalaulah dalam uh, dalam abstract itu not specify, right? Uh, not specify what the variable that they are using, right? Uh, then baru you masuk ke dalam artikel tersebut, 
right uh, you first jump into the methodology right uh, the science methodology we explain right uh, what are the variable right uh, that uh, used at the particular study right uh, to test right uh, example some study they are the uh, dinyatakan they are going to treat uh, moderating mediating control variable and as well part of the dependent and independent variable right so the findings right now also sometimes uh, these people uh, some article only uh, stated the most important finding right now in the abstract okay if you want to know the detail about the finding, you go to the finding section, uh, discussions and conclusion sections. Right now, they will show you what they have found. Right now, what they've been studied in their research. Apa yang dipelajari, apa yang boleh dipelajari dalam uh, the particular uh, article. Uh, have been study have been conducted. So you put this uh, in this table. Okay, use this table. Right now, uh, it's so helpful. Right? So, your literature review chapters uh, should contain uh, introduction, define the topic, providing contents review literature, right, uh, the body, group of the literature according to the common themes, and the conclusion summary contribute to the literature. Right? Uh, so, to be specific, example tadi, uh, ni. Right, uh, this is your literature review chapter's structure. The structure of your literature. If you can find here, bagai contoh, this study, dia nak test customer uh, satisfaction and the business performance. This is cost and effect. Sebab uh, dan akibat. Right, uh, sebab uh, uh, penyebab dia adalah customer satisfaction. Customer satisfaction ni akibat dia kalau customer to satisfied, Akibat dia adalah a performance, whether good performance, right, then it is performance and etc. Right. In other words, we can say that this is the independent variable. Right. Huh? So business performance is dependent variable. Okay. Maksudnya, this is independent. Independent variable means it can standing alone. However, business performance but that business performance depends on the customer satisfaction. Itu dikatakan dependent variable. Right, uh, so I repeat, business performance is dependent variable where this depend on this. Right, uh, business performance depend on the customer satisfaction. So customer satisfaction is independent variable. So business performance is dependent variable, right? So the past yeah, after the business performance, previous study found that, right, uh, this if the if independent and dependence, independence and dependent variable have strong relationship, right? Uh, next, it will find the customer retention and customer loyalty. Right. So, in when you write the literature, right, uh, first, right, uh, you need to define, right, uh, you need to review, put that, right, uh, this section, independent variable. Lepas tu baru you cerita pasal your dependent variable. Okay? So, that is what contents uh, in your uh, uh, LR. Give you example of bad and better literature review. A bad review. Uh, they say that I find that the bad review. Such harassment has many consequences. Adam at all found that someone study say avoided taking class working and blah 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 blah. Vincent Thompson study social problem and such harassment. The excellent book the Richard uh, uh, give a long list of difficulty victim suffered. Okay. Kenapa dikatakan why it said this is the bad review? Sebab right now these uh, articles 
the report uh, is not synthesizing the articles. Uh, nah, dia jadi reporter. Dia report satu-satu. Study A, apa yang dia cerita dalam study A. Then this is study B. Right now what they find is study B. Study C, what they find is study C. One by one. Right. The good LR, we need to synthesizing. We can shorten this statement. Right now, kalau di sini ada 3, 6, 7. Right now, dapat 7 line. In fact, if you synthesizing, you can make this only in one sentence. Uh, see? Right, uh, so, better reuse a victim social uh, from lower esteem, low confidence, withdrawal or social change, the goal and depression. Right, uh, maksudnya, this statement right, have proven by Adam, Benson, Kent and Witt. Right, uh, so, uh, Adam, Benson and uh, uh, Dijah Abrena ini have been conducted research on this area. Right, uh, for example, Adam say that uh, uh, this is just example as compared to just one. Right, uh, the bad review, right now, uh, you jadi reporter. Right, uh, explain one by one, not synthesizing. Right, uh, so ini yang dikatakan, this is the way we review. Right, uh, in your own uh, in your own words, right, uh, in your in your own sentence, right, uh, we are synthesizing, right, uh, this research, right, uh, and people says, if you write like this, nampak sangat you copy paste, you baca Adam, you copy the punya statement, when you baca uh, Benson and Thompson study, right, uh, you copy paste the statement. Right now, uh, then you go to the Z a winner, uh, you copy paste the punya statement. Right now, uh, so ini menyebabkan you punya nanti turning in, right now, uh, more than 30%. Uh, copy pasting. Right now, uh, but when you review, right now, uh, you read the articles, right now, uh, you comment on the articles, right now, uh, find the similarity and uh, differences, uh, right in the, this example of the good uh, literature review writing. Okay, this ini yang dikatakan we review right, the literature. Right, uh, there are three literature. There are three previous study. There are three articles. Right, uh, that you put uh, new visions, new perspective from this research. Right, uh? Okay, use of signaling words in the literature review. Right, uh, uh, this is some to to guide. Right, uh, macam mana nak buat nak buat synthesizing. Right, uh, you can you can use the continual signal. Uh, when there are more ideas to come. Right, uh, uh, continual signal. Uh, for example, right, uh, uh, study uh, conducted uh, study previous study uh, or the studies. Right, A 2021, B 2022, and C 2023. Right, now, a study have been conducted right, now, uh, in the West country, Western country, found that motivation, blah, 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 blah. Right. In the other stu uh, study, right, now, uh, by, uh, so you study the opinion citations, right, have been conducted right, now, uh, uh, in Japan, right, now, Asian uh, Asian country found that motivation something something something. Right. However, study which be conducted in the Middle East according to blah 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 blah. Right. Uh, so what they're finding? Maksudnya itu ada continuity. Uh, you grouping. Right. Uh, you grouping the this previous study based on uh, what do you call locations. Right. Uh, you can group. You synthesize your your literature. Right now, your review can be based on demographic. Right now, study ABC conducted right now, uh, student, uh, primary school students. Right now, another group of studies conducted for the secondary students. Right now, based on age. Right now, or can based on the 
uh, in here direction sequences time uh, nationality differences right now uh, what are, are based on what the important finding into the less important findings right now uh, so this is then in process cause of results right now uh, or spatial sig uh, signal Com you do a comparison uh, a and b is like contoh macam uh, yang ni tadi this is a, a combination uh, they combine the main uh, the main finding right now ada mungkin banyak lagi bukan just study on social interaction saja right now tapi this is the most important finding according to Adam Benson and Thompson right now dia punya main finding right now they say uh, they study on the change curve goal Je and Regner right now study on the depression but these three find that these three important finding from these three uh, three research uh, uh, study on the the punya DV could be uh, dependent variable they all sama right uh, self esteem loss in self confidence tapi dia punya uh, independent uh, independent variable right uh, uh, berbeza that's why uh, they boleh group these together right uh, uh, they sharing the same uh, dependent variable Ha, cuma berbeza antara tiga artikel uh, ini adalah dia punya independent artikel, uh, independent variable. Okay. Citations and quotation is very important. Right, uh, and also dalam dalam folder, right, uh, uh, ID to put, if I'm not mistaken, ada APA uh, citation guide. Right, uh, Academy of American apa nama dia? APA. Eh, lupa lah. Nanti kamu carilah. Right, uh, so, oh ni, APA referencing. Apa maksudnya APA tu? Hmm, American Personality Academy. Ah, macam tu lah. Okay. But for Malaysia, right now Malaysia University we follow the APA uh, standards right now APA format right now when we do referencing right now there are banyak referencing style MLA or something uh, banyak but uh, kita guna APA so macam mana nak, nak, nak uh, buat citation using the AP, APA referencing style right now you look into the file and read Right now, macam mana nak tulis uh, references? Right now, kalau uh, you find it from journal, right now, if you are reading using the books, right now, or you are referring to the some website, maybe some report, the World Organization's report, right now, the Ministry report, where you find that report, you have to put that in the uh, in your references list. Right now, as I mentioned before, for the introduction part, we introduction about the issues, introduction about the problem. Right now, we can refer to the general report, but must be trusted sources. Trusted sources may be the, the ministry, the government, institutions, right now, that uh, which highlight on certain issue that you're interested in. Okay. Right now, so this is the how we are writing the referencing right so quotations you quote uh, now when we referring when we referring uh, the previous study we can we need to quote uh, that the author and the year of the articles is published so the love you for your referencing this is how you write that uh, now quotations try to avoid try to minimize this is called direct quotations. Right, uh, direct quotations is the uh, is needed where uh, how to say there are statement that very important. Hello, you baca previous study. Right, uh, if you look into the previous study, most of the study cite of that particular quotations. Right, uh, as, but contoh, 
benda uh, statement yang tak boleh diubah. Right, nah? Ayat Al-Quran, for, for example, isn't it? Right, nah? You study on the, you interested interested to study on the spiritual intelligence. When we talk about spiritual intelligence, right, nah? it refer to uh, probably some religions. Right, nah? You want to discuss about the importance of the intelligence. So in Al-Quran say that, right, nah? you cite some a verse from a Quran, right now you cannot change that verse. So what we can do, put in the form of a uh, bracket macam ni, right? Uh, put the bracket, right? Uh, so this is the uh, the the words, the statement that we cannot change, but we need to put the sources. Okay, itu dipanggil quotations. Kalau citations Right now, citation, we are um, just referring right now to the particular. Right now, so referring ini, ayat yang, yang from here, supply, change, management, until customer, bukan maksudnya copy paste. Okay, this author, review, uh, uh, kata apa, review, comment, uh, study yang dibuat Aram and Cooper. Right, uh, so they say that here, according to uh, a club and cover, supply chain management is where people integrate philosophy to manage the total flow of distribution channel from supplier to ultimate customer. Right, uh, it is a statement daripada uh, author of this research. Tapi, <coughs> sorry, he is referring to Elam and Cooper. Okay, itu maksudnya citations. Right now, we have to cite the article. Right now, kenapa? This is to add into yang tadi saya cerita pasal credibility. Kalau you tak buat citations, right now, but you have this statement, right now, people my questions. Supply chain management integrate philosophy manage total flow distribution channel from supplier to ultimate customer. People can question. How do you know? Right, uh, is it true or not? Right, uh, integrating supply chain maksudnya uh, is the process how we manage distribution channel. How do you know? Right, uh, so we tell people, yes, I know this condition where right, uh, supply chain is the process right, uh, people manage the flow distribution channel from supplier to the customer according to Aram and Cooper. Right now, have been conducted. Right now, Aram and Cooper define supply chain management as the process way to integrate right now, the flow from this uh, from supplier to ultimate customer. Okay, itu yang dikatakan dengan source of credibility into our academic writing. Right, now, you have to cite right now, uh, the sources where where you find that article. Bukan maksudnya setiap ayat perlu citations. Right, eh? The key here is setiap idea perlu citations. Baik contoh dalam satu perenggan itu, right, eh? you can write something just a general statement on the topic, uh, on the particular uh, area that you want to discuss. Right, eh? Then the second and third line that you refer to previous study, right? Uh, from that con uh, condition, then you put some uh, concluding statement for that particular uh, particular area that you are discussing at that particular paragraph. Okay. And so, what is the difference between references and bibliography? References, sections where you credit original writer that have cited quotation body of assignment. Right now, maksudnya, every name that you cite in the main text in your writing, right now, you need to put in the references, uh, reference list. Right now, setiap nama yang kita catat, yang kita uh, cite, in the body, uh, in the text, right, uh, you need to put the sources in the reference list. Bibliography, 
right now the sources right now that we are refer but not necessary to cite right now in the uh, main text maksudnya beza antara references and bibliography bibliography itu hanya lah senarai right now sumber-sumber termasuk sama ada dia uh, you cite that particular article or not but you have refer to the particular site okay sebagai contoh you are referring to the uh, you are uh, you probably use uh, 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 library pitar right nah, tapi you tak cite pun nama pitar in your in your writing nah, tapi you just 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 lihat saja right nah, so you can put that in bibliography references wajib right nah, sekiranya you cite the names in your right uh, in your writing right so nanti when you submit your uh, your research report right nah, saya akan check right nah, adakah nama-nama yang yang timbul in your in the in the text in the body you ada put in the reference or not kalau nama tak tersebut sumber tersebut tidak ada dalam references Right, eh? Some indicator is you copy paste from somewhere. Okay, so it can be some technical thing, but this is important. Okay, right, eh? so by contoh, if your bibliography you refer to the book, this is how we write the books. Right, eh? David, right, eh? the book is the management. Right, eh? what editions, uh, publication place. Right now, and the publisher. Right, kalau articles ataupun chapters in the books, right now, the name of the author, right now, the name of the uh, uh, no, the particular articles, and this is the books, right now, place, and the publisher. Right now, kalau you refer to the newspaper, right now, name of the author, Right now, specific date of the particular area. What are the title of the articles? Right now, what newspaper it is? What page? Right now, kalau tidak dinyatakan siapa dia punya author, right now, you just put uh, the uh, apa ni? Dia punya title of the articles. Right now, date of uh, of the articles. Right now, the uh, newspaper, the source, and what page? Okay. Kalau journal, right, uh, name of the author, name of the articles, name of the journal, right, uh, what, uh, uh, apa ni? what volume, volume of the journal, and what page. Right, uh, kalau satu. Right, uh, kalau dia lebih daripada uh, eight or more. Right, nah, satu research yang besar, yang lama saja, eh, yang uh, terlalu banyak, terlalu ramai dia punya author, you can put up to five. One, two, three, four, five. Ini lebih. Nah, uh, you can put up to five uh, first author, right, nah, and the year. Name of the articles, name of the journal, volume editions, and the page. Okay, for the internet sources, I uh, already have this in the guideline there, how to synthesize. Okay. Printed, this is dissertations. Abyss. Any questions? 